this morning. That's why I got the belly. <laughs> <laughs> We've been wanting to try this place. <laughs> we went out to breakfast. It's four o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> well, we had bre we got there at like 11. Lies. We ate like at two. One. Yeah. It was a long two. wait. Yeah, okay. That's, yeah, that's fine. Big. But I, we waited a long line, but it wasn't worth it. So tried it. And then we went to Victoria Gardens, exchanged my dad's boots, got a coffee. And now we're experiencing all this weird ice everywhere. <laughs> I thought you were going to say weird ass weather. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's you. <laughs> surprise, surprise, I'm with my dad. Saturday, we're going shopping. It's a rainy Saturday. California is becoming Washington. Oh, cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> You're so extreme. <laughs> We're going to Coles because it's six days of rain all year and it's becoming Washington. Oh my god. Every vlog it's raining, Dad. <laughs> Every vlog. Yeah, we're going to Coles. Need to get an outfit so I'm not wearing the same thing all the time. Honestly, we'll see. I'm pretty picky, so probably won't find anything, but worth a try. So. Not with that attitude. So let's go. a bust so we're gonna go to Target I mean you can't really blame them I'm looking for warm clothes because it's gonna be raining tonight and it's spring so they have like a spring line honestly I'm probably not gonna be able to find anything anyways why the hell are we running around in the rain if you don't think you're gonna find anything pessimist fine I just want to hang out with you can I just hang out with you of course because as soon as I get home I have to take a shower do my hair I didn't even notice it was already 1 30 yeah it's crazy Back home, Target was also a bust. We got breakfast for two o'clock in the afternoon. I really wanted chocolate chip pancakes the other day. So today we got chocolate chips, but now I'm craving blueberry waffles. I'm gonna make some eggs. Just whip that up real quick because I need to start washing my hair. My friends are probably gonna be here like seven. I mean, it's much later. The reservation's for nine o'clock. We're going to the Beetle House. I've always heard about the Beetle House, but never been there. It's like a Beetlejuice inspired restaurant slash bar. They have like performances and then like themed food and themed drinks. And it's like $65 for a three course meal. And I think it comes with a drink too. I'm not sure, but I need to look at the menu too before I go. Just so I'm not like staring at all these things. I like to look at pictures and see what looks good. I guess we're meeting up at uh, the rest. Re ugh. We have the reservation for eight o'clock and not nine o'clock. I thought it was nine o'clock. So I quickly called my friend and was like, what did I say? But I guess I told them the right time. So the friend that I'm carpooling with, at least I told them the right time. In my head, it was nine o'clock. So I wasn't going to be ready by then. So I kind of started rushing quickly. We have good time. And I want to finally <laughs> unbox this. I know it's terrible. It's just been sitting here. I wanted to initially film like a dedicated like short for it, but time just kind of went by and now it's ridiculous. And now I feel even more ridiculous that I haven't unboxed it because I've been pretty consistent with my Peloton, not this week. Besides this week, I was pretty consistent and this would come in handy. This is the Galaxy Watch 6. I just want to connect it. Cause I don't really like being on my phone when I'm out with my friends. At the same time, if I get a phone or something, I want to be aware. So I believe this is the 44 to 70 millimeter. This is the 20 millimeter medium large band and like a gray. I didn't really want to get white because I was like nervous of it getting dirty. So I didn't want to do white. So I thought the off gray was good because I had the black strap before and I just felt like it looked very masculine. So the box comes with the little charger and it's C port. Let's start. 
This one is so much more sleek than my other one. I felt like my other one was very beveled. This is very flat. Like I didn't even realize I had never gotten a screen protector for my other one, but this one feels like I should get one because the quality is really crisp. This is really pretty. It looks a little big on my hand. Okay, so now it has to download the software. I'm gonna let it do what it needs to do and I think I am going to go to Starbucks because I have a free drink and my points are gonna expire tomorrow so that means I will lose my free drink and plus since I'm gonna stay a little bit longer tonight it's okay that it's like past five o'clock Starbucks and then my friend texted me and it was like, oh, we're gonna be like 6 10, 6 11. So we rushed home and I changed quickly. Couldn't find anything at Target, Cole, so just long sleeve shirt, my Levi's, and then of course, I'm gonna finish it off with my black jean jacket. But I'm actually gonna wear my Doc Martin platforms out. I usually only wear those to concerts, but since I'm not driving, it's gonna be kind of rainy tonight. I think it's perfect. And I think I'm trying to convince myself too that I can wear Doc Martin so I can buy another pair. Jared and Kat have brought me. We tried figuring out this parking thing. Very high tech now. You have to scan a QR code and then park in certain locations. And the greeter not the was others. very welcoming. Oh yeah, always. <laughs> Did I ever tell you in LA you have the best customer service? They love doing their job. <laughs> Oh yeah, they were so happy. That's what you call service with a smile. <laughs> Red car <laughs> Ambiance is cool, it's like an eight, but the shows themselves, two. And the service was pretty bad. Service, like, and, yeah, And then they zero. want to charge you like $70. Yeah, no. That was pretty crazy. No, not good. The yeah. only good part was seeing Chucky, Chucky hit the McGritty <laughs> Fortnite <laughs> the dance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, Chucky was pretty cool. I like Pee Wee Herman. Oh, Pee Wee Herman was cool. Nah. I felt like um, Beetlejuice was a little abrasive. But was... Beetlejuice is abrasive. Yeah. So. No, but he was like a little too much like... I just want to eat, you know? It's like that girl started singing and I'm like, I couldn't even hear the waiter and she couldn't hear me. And, and she gave you the wrong order? Said, I don't want sriracha sauce, I don't want this. She didn't hear me say any of that because the person singing, I'm like, this is stupid. Why are you setting up your business like this? There's already other industry standard ones that already have set this, just set dedicated time. Jared, you should open up your business. No, it sounds like a lot of work. <laughs> I'm back home. That was a pretty big bust, honestly. I was pretty excited all week because I've been wanting to go to the Beetle House for a very long time. Yeah, that was, that was a bust, very overrated. There were so many things that could have been done better. The food was so bad, which is why I'm having a Klondike bar because I really wanted something sweet and that chocolate cake was just not it. I ended up throwing it all away. Like, 
I'm usually really big on not wasting food and like bringing home food home, but none of that was worth it. Service was so bad. Performances weren't even themed and they took forever between each song. My friend was talking about we would have just like spent the money on just buying drinks and like eating somewhere else. Maybe it'd be better just so you can get the ambiance and the performances. But, like the food was like honestly 100% not worth it. Nothing like not one of them was good. I'm pretty wired because I had coffee so late. I'm gonna watch Saltburn. I haven't seen it, but everybody keeps on talking about it. I don't know, it's kind of a bummer. It sucks too, because we couldn't even like talk with like our friends or anything like that. We went in a group of 10 people and we couldn't even like talk to each other because they like separated us into two different booths. And it was so loud in there that even like the people next to me, I couldn't hear them or my friends couldn't hear us, so. But I'm just gonna watch Saltburn. Probably just relax for the rest of the night. day <laughs> so i actually woke up fairly early today because i really really wanted to get a vlog out i've been slacking on my uploads on consistency so i wanted to make sure that i got up early this morning and edited my vlog and i did so this is actually the earliest i've ever gone done with a vlog i usually like finish at like 10 o'clock at night and then i'm like quickly like in the morning editing my thumbnail it's terrible got the vlog up and um i was really really craving ramen because it's so cold and i had a terrible dinner last night so i was craving ramen so looked up this ramen place it has like a 4.8 rating so i hope it's good so that's where we're gonna head out right now and then probably after we'll edit my thumbnail but it's a very very cold cold day today I decreased it way too much. Uh-uh, it tastes like water. Okay, I already washed my face with the First Aid Beauty. And honestly, I'm really liking it. It's not drying at all. I really like it so far, but it was kind of expensive for those little things, so definitely gonna look out for sales for that. So since I already washed my face in the shower, we are gonna put the rest of the stuff on. So I also bought this kit a couple of vlogs ago. So it has the toners, the serums, eye gels, and moisturizers. And then on top of that, I can exfoliate today. So I'm gonna be use the Murad vitamin C triple exfoliating. Then I use this for my eye cream. This is my Murad retinol eye cream. So I'm also going to use the Murad vitamin C serum. First though is the exfoliator. I have to put this on and I let it like sit on my face for about 10 minutes it says. It says to rub it in your face until it turns white. Let's sit for 10 minutes. 